and he thought he could become the only dragon. Well, he didn't realize I'm a R1 spam master. So he dropped the headpiece, right? We got the body. Stone and be with the power of the everlasting dragon. Screen the head of the dragon, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So I think you get two sets. One is the basic set of dragon stuff. The other one has a lot more power into it. In this video, we are basically going to try to beat the base game. So here we are at the Arch Dragon Peak. Um, I did go back and level up once my vitality is at 25 now. We are level 91. So a very good area to be for the end of the game. I believe that this boss we're about to fight is the hardest boss in the game. So this is this is really cool man they they added this in either to retcon everyone's inquiry about who was Gwen's firstborn or this is planned from the beginning if you look at the altar of the sunlight in Dark Souls 1 it's all smashed it's a statue that's all smashed up but you can see the feet. The feet look just like what this guy's feet look like. His sandals. His weapon, the, the cross spear, looks the same. And it's only fitting that we are dressed as Solaire. Um, I couldn't farm his shield, but it's okay. We'll do without. Calls in this fog. You call in this fog from the bell, which is really... Um, uh, shitty. <laughs> Unfortunately, you can now walk whee, on the fog. But uh, it really messes with my depth perception. I'm sorry, but I, I will miss greatly in this fight. There's two phases to this fight. We are wearing the iron garb. We have a plus 10 claymore, a plus 5, plus plus five black knight shield we have stamina health lightning protection and physical protection i still believe we are missing one estus we'll have to go and find that somewhere i'm going to use lightning i don't know if, i know lightning probably works on the first part of this fight on the second part i'm assuming it does not here we go my depth perception camera and depth perception are the biggest part of this fight uh when you fight the second phase, he is very fast, but his attacks are very slow, so that also messes with you. <clears throat> Here we go. I mean, what a cool entrance. King of Storms. Dodge. Got struck. And that's the story. Um, I have beaten this guy once or twice, uh, but it's, he's just tough. It's just very tough. Um, the trick, I think the trick is learning where to stand. If you find yourself standing under the dragon, you're going to have a hard time. Number one, because of the camera. Sucks. Number two, because... He will 
do moves to prevent you from being under him, like the fire attack. The lock on, I like the lock on, but it's probably not recommended in this phase because um, you'll you'll lose it, you'll be confused, you will. Staying in front of him is scary, but it's a better way to fight him. If you're under him, the camera sucks. He shoots fire that sucks. Um, <clears throat> but now the real Dark Souls begins. Um, what was lame about that is I was trying to use an ember, and it's slower than the Estus. So as I was uh, figuring out that I wanted to use an ember, uh, let me figure it out. I got speared. He's got quite a range on his spears. He's very fast in his movements, right? Who, 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 lunging. But when he actually attacks, it is very delayed. So it's, you gotta kind of pay attention and don't get greedy. We'll hit him once or twice. I might even just two hand, get rid of the uh, sword all together. Lightning works well on dragons. I don't think lightning works well on him. I rolled into that and got hit. Take me forever to stand up. Should I start this one over? Fire. Yep. Start this one over. I definitely dodged that first one, but it wasn't a dodge. It was like, oh, you're going to spear? I mean, literally somersault into it. Yeah, it just sliced my back wide open. I hope you guys are ready, because this is the next hour. And what sucks is, it is a fun fight, but like most fights that have, um, damn it, what was I going to do? I was going to do something. No, I can't remember. Oh, um, 
like most fights that have two or three health bars, right? So you got to fight the dragon, and then the real uh, king comes out or whatever. The, the nameless king. Like most fights that have two health bars, one of them is really fun. One of them is really fun. One of them sucks, though. This dragon fight is not fun. It's not fun. Um, I missed all three of those. Literally missed every single shot that was. make short work of them. Alright, let's watch this one more time because it's awesome, and then from the, then on, we'll, uh, look at his, his sandals with the wrappings. They look just like the sunlight altar. His sword, his sword spear looks just like the cross spear. I would love to fight him, right? But having to go through the dragon part ruins the fight because it's like, alright man, this dragon sucks. I want to I wanna fight the good fight. But, that just doesn't happen. Okay, let's remember, if we're going to Ember, we really need time to do it. <laughs> he looks cool, though, man. Look at that armor. That's sick. Oh, we didn't dodge that second one. No, no, no! Uh, what happened? Got snagged a little bit, right? Got snagged a little bit on his... He did a, he did a swooping slash, and I thought he was gonna come with a backhand, but he did not come. So I think that messed up my timing. All right, our souls are gone. We don't care. know that was coming. best time to use it, but we did. I dodged that. I dodged that. I'm off. Please get up. Nope. 
I didn't know he was going to do three. Come on, man. That's a three hit combo. I'm dead. Alright, here we go. That was easy enough just to walk under. That slams down. Stagger. Repent! Oh, God. Nope. No, 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 First try. <laughs> Ooh, God, I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it like a polar bear picture. And he's gone. And he is gone. Game freezes. <laughs> System data corrupted. Soul of the Nameless King. So this is that second gate that wasn't open before, and now it is. I got a little greedy at the end, and it was kind of scary because it's like, I'm going to die. But I just backed up and said, we just need to hit him once. We just need to hit him once. All right. Soul of the Nameless King. The Nameless King was once a dragon-slaying god of war before he sacrificed everything to ally himself with the ancient dragons. So Gwyn and the lords found the first flame and defeated it. They had a war for the surface and they destroyed the dragons. And Gwyn's firstborn son, a god of war, tra was a traitor. And Gwyn destroyed all the statues of him, and he was erased from history. <laughs> Titanite slab. Titanite slab. This is a cool little area. This is the arena. It was just shrouded in, um, shrouded in mist. And then that is how we got the spear. Remember Ornstein's spear? Well, Ornstein was a beloved knight of Gwyn. He protects the holy city on Norlando. He eventually leaves his post, and the last man remaining is Smo, the big fat one. Well, <clears throat> why did Ornstein leave? Did he have a beef with somebody? And the coolest armor in the game.
Dragon Slayer armor, Golden Lion armor associated with Dragon Slayer Ornstein from the Ages of the Gods imbued with the strength of lightning. In the Dragonless Age, this knight who long guarded the ruined cathedral left the land in search of the nameless king. So, Ornstein may be like, hey, this fool, I'm here to kill dragons, and he bought, he, you know, he, he allied, allied, allied? He, he aligned himself with the dragons, so we have to go kill him. But you see, his fate was matched, or his, his match was faded. What? Basically, the nameless king kills him. And very close by is another friend, Havel. So, kind of interesting. Kind of interesting. <laughs> 80,000 souls. I believe that's all you get in here is you get the Dragon Slayer stuff. And, um... We will definitely wear the Dragon Slayer armor. But I think I have the perfect fight for it in mind. So just be patient, and we will put it on soon. Let us return from when Style came. So that's it. There's one boss left. We defeated all four lords. We defeated the Nameless King, who is the optional area boss. <clears throat> We went down and defeated the Dragon King, or not the Dragon King, the Demon King. He was, um, he was in the fiery area of the catacombs. Aha, so. Lightning Storm, call forth furious lightning. Miracle of the Nameless King, to allied to the ancient dragons, call forth furious bolts of lightning. Once the Slayer of Dragons, the former king and war god, tamed a storm drake on which he led a lifetime of battle, this miracle is likely the tale of their bond. Oh, how sweet. And then his uh, storm curved sword. Curved sword imbued with the strength of the storm drake. The nameless king, ally of the ancient dragons, fought beside the storm drake in countless battles. When the great beast fell, the king claimed his soul as it was custom in the age gods. The skill of the tornado. Remember, he was throwing up stuff. Wait a minute, that's not... Soul of the Nameless King. Soul of the Nameless King. What is this? Soul of the Nameless King. Oh, it gives you three things. And then this is his dragon hunting weapon from the age of the gods. The earliest form of the cross spear served as both sword and spear. Its owner was the Nameless King and defect hunter of dragons. The sword spear is imbued with lightning in which he was heir. It literally looks like Masters of the Universe, He-Man's sword of power. I have the power by the power of Grayskull. Yeah. Now, now. Do not. Now, now. So, let's see. Oh, I did um, give the ashes to her, I believe. Which gave me more... Nameless. 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 So, two rings down here. Boost damage absorption when HP is full. I think we already have that. Slows equipment degradation. Why would you ever wear that? <laughs> they, this game doesn't... Ashen one. <laughs> Wait, let's do this. Ashen one. Welcome. Very well, then take none. Let these souls be All right, I guess we'll just rush to fifty. Farewell, Ashen one. Liege. Speak freely, thy lordship. I am at thy beck and call. Be safe. <laughs> A 
how... Ashen one. Crown of the Nameless King, who is allied to the Ancient Dragon. The Lord stands of personally Ash and is said to closely resemble that of the First Lord. So it, it reminds you of Gwyn's hair, if you will. Dragon scale armor. Where is it? Is it a skirt? Wait a minute. Nameless Knight. I don't want Nameless Knight. Okay. Huh. They're all named something different? That's really weird. Unless the hand wraps are not the hand wraps that I'm... Hmm. Anyways, <clears throat> that's it. I love that headpiece. Okay, we have one more boss to fight, which I will do in one second, but there is something that I wanted to do. Rosaria's bedchambers. I think this is an NPC we can fight. I would love to know where I missed the last Estus Shard. Maybe off camera, I'll run around trying to find... Oh god, I choke him on a spit. I'll run around and try to find it. It's got to be in one of... Uh, 15 locations, I guess. And if I do find it, I'll tell you guys where I missed it. So remember, Rosario was the Pale Tongue, the invaders, and then we talked to, uh, what's his name? Um, Leonhard, and he said, you don't have to be a comrade to invade. And we come here and we see she's fallen over. Black Eye Orb, and you cannot, oh, and you can still do everything, that's weird, and usually the Black Eye Orbs are for specific invasions, invade the world of Rosaria's killer, Arcane Orb left on Rosaria corpse have faith her soul can be retrieved by invading the world of her killer and returning victorious the black eye is proof of vengeance but often appears serene as it casts its gaze toward irithel you know what it looks like to me it looks like a, a belial a, a bell the helmet it looks like the egg of the king from berserk yeah that thing the thing that uh, griffith wears around his neck so, I want to say he is here. Oh, man, I need a stretch. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. I'll let you guys wonder if I really did the movements while I sung that. The answer is no. No, I did not. Okay, so we have elevators.
once you have the eye, I, I don't know. I, I've never, I've never liked the aspect of these eyes, right? Because the whole purpose is to play the game. You find out somebody's killed somebody, so you're like, oh, I found the black eye orb, and then you're supposed to go through the game, and the black eye orb will suddenly start quivering, right? You feel the black eye orb quivering, okay? And now you can use it. You can't use it anywhere else until you find it quivering. However, we've already been to this area. We've already been to Rosario. So unless you're actually hunting down this quest line, it doesn't happen naturally. And that's kind of like, in my opinion, a misstep. Like, it would be cool as if you came to her, she was dead. You couldn't even talk to her, and you're like, oh, she's already dead. Then you find it, then you go through the game. A couple bosses later, it starts quivering, oh, and then you can use it. But this is really, we're just literally hunting him down. And we are invading his world. Oh, I should have got my parry shield out. Estashard, the game is mocking me. Hey, remember? Memba Estashard, you're supposed to have 15. Well... Well, never expected to see you here. Couldn't resist her any longer in all her festering glory. And now you want to ravage her soul as well. I sow the seeds, I'll prune the mess. I, Leonard, swear so on my vows to the gods. No one will despoil her soul. Certainly no beast wrapped in human skin. Ooh, that's cool. Dude, I tipped him with that. Come on. They got the elevators blocked off. You missed. Great weapon missed. You're going to run out of mana at some point. Oh, that didn't... You is bitch. Oh, no healing. Sick beast. Oh, blessed Rosaria. Oh. Oh. So he was taught he was tough. Um, I'm no good at PvP. So he was talking about her soul. Her soul. What are you gonna do with her soul? What was he gonna do with his soul? He was gonna use it to invade and pillage, I guess, and become the new covenant type deal? I don't know. People do odd things. Like it's gold in PvP. Oh man, Soul of Azaria, Crescent Moon Sword, and the Silver Mask. Oh man, how do you get the rest of his armor? Bloodborne armor. Bloodborne armor. Bloodborne armor. Ouchie. So, let's see here. Soul of Azaria, Mother of Rebirth, stolen by Ringfinger Leonhard. Return this to extant, ex, extant corpse. Return this to her extant corpse, and Mother of Azaria will spring back to life as if nothing ever happened. So, I don't, does she give you anything worthwhile? What else did we get? Some sort of spell from him, right? No his weapon 
Crescent Moon Sword, Ring Finger, Leonhardt's weapon of choice, a type of shodel imbued with the power of the moon. Leonhardt set out on a journey of rebirth, but decided instead to serve the goddess as a knight and inherited this weapon. And his hat, that's right. Try fold hat. There it is. Silver mask of ring finger, Leonhard. In this youth, Leonhard suffered great burns to his entire body, his face in particular, which he hid beneath his mask, which was terribly scald. He abstained from restoring these injuries even after becoming a. Oh, so he always wanted to rem remember being scarred. And look, Gwen, Guinevere, and no statue. No statue. He turned on him, so he had all the statues destroyed. All right. <clears throat> Let's beat the game. Let's beat the game. I am going to play both DLCs, but I am going to go ahead and beat the last boss and roll credits. Now, you don't have to sit through the credits with me. What I'll do is I'll probably say, hey, peace out, and stop the video, and then the next time we come back, we'll go ahead and dive into the DLCs. <coughs> oh, God. Oh. I'm dying. Restore soul. Sure. Oh god. That must be part of her body. And that's it. Oh. So, uh, she gives you nothing? Come on, man. Brought you back to life. Give me something. Give me something. Travel to the shrine. Maybe we can buy his armor. Bloodborne style. The Nameless King, Friend of the Dragons. I don't know if there's any cool... any cool bosses to fight as him. We'll see. Ah, uh -huh. how... Huh. So you don't get his armor. I wonder if it's just armor of something else. One. Be sure. Shut up. This is where he was standing, and there was no, um, there's no armor there. Offer Prince Lothric's. I guess we should have read that. Well, um, and sadly, our friend here has to has to go. God, that scream! Skull ring. So you can still come and do the stuff um, after you reset the level. Oh, she walked forward. She walked forward. Let's. Fire. And in very much Dark Souls fashion, I bought this a while ago, but I was saving it. I was saving it for this moment. For this moment. Armor said to have been given to elite knights of fallen Astora. The mere mention of Astora invokes wistful pangs, and perhaps <clears throat> it is such a dream that drew Henri to this far faraway home known as only by name. Well, I guess that's okay. So there it is, the elite armor. Actually, not that cool looking in this game. I love, 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 love the elite knight armor, elite knight armor in Dark Souls 2. Okay. <clears throat> Let's 
One of Cortland's transposed wonders derived from the soul of the Soul Feeder, easier to be detected by enemies. The Soul Feeder was the beast that insatiably absorbed souls to feed its own power. Even after its accursed corpse was burned, it is said that the pungent stench of souls left the air permanently stained. So this Soul Feeder creature was burned. Didn't Ludliff say his legs were burned off or something to that effect? Maybe Ludliff had to defeat the Soul Feeder, or maybe he tricked him into defeating him, and he linked the fire. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I do want to look at this hat, though. Wait a minute. It's cool, but it doesn't fit with, you know, what we're doing. I guess, I guess maybe the, um... Maybe the Bloodborne armor he was wearing is an armor in the game that we've already picked up. We just don't recognize it. So we don't have any Estus shards. We don't have any ashes. We don't have any bone shards to do. We put all of the Lord Souls back. We have beaten all the bosses. Remember, we are with Yuria. We are with Yuria to become the Lord of Hollows. We set all these down, and the fire keeper, she walked up. The five lords sit their five thrones. All thanks to thee, most worthy of lords. Ashen one, with the lords as thy witness, bend thy knee afore the bonfire's coiled sword, and let the lords' embers acknowledge thee as their true heir. A true lord, fit to link the fire. Farewell, Asher, may the flames guide thee. So, I absolutely love the last boss in this game. I think it is a perfect Perfect. Noble Lords of Cinder. The fire fades. And if you didn't kill Ludliff, he'd kill himself right there. And the Lords go without thrones. Surrender your fire. to the true heir. I think it's a perfect homage homage to Dark Souls players and Dark Souls bosses. Because we're gonna fight basically every kind of style. Great sword, scimitar, thief, magic wielder, miracle wielder, lightning spear. And then you get a little twinge, a little twinge of a beautiful Deliverers of the first flame. Beautiful twinge of music plays at the end. <clears throat> that uh, it played in Gwyn's boss fight. So, killing of the first flame. We're going to light this bonfire. And we're going to get out of here. This is... This is the Firelink Shrine. It's all completely destroyed. The Kiln of the First Flame. So this is where it all began, the linking of the fire. We see the dark sign in the distance. Another bonfire here. Oh no, what? No, 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 no. What? Oh, wait a minute. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. 
You have to warp twice, which makes no sense. However, there is a bonfire here that will take you to the second DLC if you did not buy the first DLC, which is really weird. So yeah, this is the ruined world, man. It's all, like, we were just there, and we warp up here. I don't know why. Maybe for PvP reasons. But the world is warping upon itself. God, bonfire lit, bonfire lit, bonfire lit. We're gonna go and fight the last boss representation of... Representation of... Londor Pale Shade. He's one of the hollows that will help you if you pledge yourself to Lordran or Lordran though. And then here is uh Yuria. Yep. They will help you in your quest. Okay. I don't know what this guy's weak to. I would assume not fire. However, let's go ahead and just use it. Ascender. Oh no! Big combo. I dodged that. Changed his stance up. Now he's got magic. Oh! We got this. Scimitar. Fire! Pyromancy. Power within. Nope, he just threw a fireball at me. I hate the homing. Alright, that's not a good idea. That's not either. Come on. No, no, no. Give me one second. Come on, man, where is the stagger? That's what I'm looking for. Spear! Damn it. There's the stagger. Phase two! That combo is nasty! I, uh, I survived because I dodged the first half of it. Gwyn's theme! Come on! Damn it. I think you could parry that. I thought he was gonna jump over me. Gwyn's grab. Gwyn's grab. I'm playing real bad. Dead. 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 Oh no, you guys! Oh, I was trying for the kill this time! What a shame, what a shame. Man, he's not, he's not very hard. <laughs> he's not very hard, I definitely got beat up a little bit, but um... Man, I was, I was going for that opening. 
Come on, 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 come on. If you summon Yuria for this fight, she will be able to give you her clothing, her armor and stuff. Um... I don't know what he's weak against, if anything. Come on, dude! Nope. Well, this sucks already. Why am I getting hit so badly? A lot longer of a lunge than I thought. The delay, the delay. So you cannot repose, but you can stagger. Stagger the shit out of him. That move sucks. Uh, 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 I was like, I'll take your magic. Then I was like, wait a minute, no, I won't. Laser beam! What? Oh my god! <laughs> Alright. Laser beam! <laughs> Kamehameha. Alright, uh, we'll stop it. God, I wanted to beat this this time. Come on, man. We only got like two or three minutes. Come on, plus the ending. Come on. Laser beam. That's a great time to hit him. I didn't know he was going to do that. I kept thinking he was going to just do the, the one big one. Magic seemed to work pretty well on him. I don't know, maybe dark? Oh, dark might work really well on him. Don't trade hits with him, you idiot! Come on, please! No, no, no. That takes forever! Terrain. The terrain helped me a lot on that. <laughs> Casting. Stupid ass magic. I don't think so. I dodged that. Spear. No, I ran into it! Come on, let me get up! I just want to get up and dodge at the same time! Move! Wrath of the Gods. That move takes so long! Dead. Come on, man! Round two! Different match! We got this! We got this! Nope. Come on. Don't roll backwards. Lightning. Yeah. 
minutes away. Staggers, heal. I dodged that. No, 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 that's a combo that you don't want. Oh, he didn't kill me. He didn't kill me. I think that's coming down on us. But we killed him! We killed him! Alright. Rip, rip the beginning of this uh, video. Soul of the Lord. Ah, we did it. Not a terrible bad fight. Soul of the Lord, one of the twisted souls. Since Lord Gwyn, the first Lord of Cinder, many exalted lords have linked the first flame, and it was their souls that have manifested themselves as defender of the flame. Well, we got something for the fire. So there's a bunch of endings, right? The fire keeper, she could help you wrestle it away. You could walk away and not care. We're going to become Lord of the Hollows. We already had a bride. We sacrificed uh, the magic guy. You guys, this has been real fun. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. I am making YouTube videos. <clears throat> I hope I did this right and can become Lord of the Hollows. Yeah, basically I steal it, right? Yeah, instead of rekindling the fire, I steal. And the dark sign grows darker. <sighs> There's Henri. Right there, on the right. Thank you very much for watching, you guys. I'm going to let the credits roll, and I will see you next time for the DLC. Peace out. Peace out, Dark Souls 3.